The femoropopliteal bypass with a saphenous vein is being performed in an in situ fashion. The initial incision is in the groin, demonstrating the proximal saphenous vein and transecting uh, the ascending branches. Saphenous vein is just beneath the scissors and is now being dissected from the proximal portion to a distal segment. Incision is made in the medial aspect of the thigh and the saphenous vein is continually dissected distally. This will permit disruption of the valves. The dissection of the femoral artery is now conducted. This is the common femoral artery into which the saphenous vein will be placed. This is the profunda and a tape has already been passed around the superficial femoral artery. The common femoral artery is opened with a pot scissors. A good lumen is demonstrated and an anastomosis is performed between the saphenous vein and the common femoral artery using proline sutures. Once that anastomosis is complete, the distal saphenous vein is transected and the valves are disrupted by passing the wire piece into the lumen. There is disruption of a valve and good flow is demonstrated. An opening is made into the popliteal artery and an anastomosis is accomplished in a similar fashion and good pulse is demonstrated throughout the saphenous vein and the incision is closed with clips.